So we parked up next to some mirrors and waterfalls and I've got to try and at least get up to that first ridge so I can see where it spits out. It's quite steep though. So I've made it all the way up. <sighs> there is another bit further up but I'm not going that high. Well an absolute stunning little walk where it is. I'm trying to watch where my feet are. But there's a vendor down there. I look at all the way around. So beautiful. Uh, now I think we'll go back down. Well, tonight's pack up. Absolutely stunning. Look at the views and the sun's out, which is just amazing. Just as we were out to go out to sky, nice couple of sunny days. What has it been? 22 degrees today. Such a child. This has to be the earliest we've ever left the park up. So we're on Sky and we are now heading to Fairy Glen, which is somewhere I've always wanted to go. So there isn't much parking there and it is quite busy. It's Thursday but it's bank holiday weekend. So we're thinking we'll get up there dead early, we'll get parked up, go and do what we want to do. We've got three days of really nice weather and then we're going to start heading towards, is it Dun Dunnaro Castle? Have I said that right or is that wrong? So the park that we had last night it was lovely. We were right next to a place where you've got to pay, and the pay is £25. Or you could buy there for free, so we just parked there, didn't we? We did. I feel like we kind of cheated a little bit, but hey ho. And it's about a 40 minute drive, ordinary drive, up to Fairy Glen. So that is the plan, so we should get there before 9 o'clock. Park up in like the little motorboat bit because apparently there's a side bit you can park for more homes. I hopefully park up there at 22 degrees so it says. Got some shorts on, got the sunnies on. Perfect. Do you want to wee shave, don't you? I do, yeah, I need to shave in the haircut. So yeah, that Before is the plan for today. Yeah. Feeling rather handsome today, I'm not gonna lie. The hair done and I think I'm just excited because I've always wanted to go to Sky. It's been on the bucket list of places to go. And we parked up yesterday, didn't we? Just off, just before the crossing to Sky, we were like, oh. We felt like we were wasting the day because it was absolutely beautiful weather. So we decided about half past four, didn't we? We were like, yep, yeah, we're going to go across. Wake up this morning and a beautiful couple of days here. And then apparently it's meant to rain for the rest of the year. Yeah? Yeah. We are tingling. <laughs> it's the UK, what do you expect for the weather? 
1st of May and we actually had the first day of actual really nice sunshine. So this is your summer. This is uh, these yeah. two days. So these are the three days. I'm gonna quickly get a tan with my dodgy leg, which is black and yellow this morning. So yeah, so suntan today and tomorrow, and then that'll last us all the way through the year. Okay. Right, I'll let him concentrate now. It's gonna talk, but. She must have because it's had them people. She's looking at that, isn't it? See, I don't like being above her because then you can see she needs a wash. <laughs> and I am not looking forward to that hill back up. But it's another beautiful day. Isn't it, Andrew? Absolutely beautiful. You're knackered already, aren't you? Yeah. We took the dogs around, so we just hit them back so we can have a quick come out and film. Yeah. Oh, we chickened out on that one. That's like the steepest thing to get up onto the top. We got to where these first lot of people are and then we were like, yeah, we don't fancy that. It's like so high to climb. Yes, that's the bit that we're not looking forward to on the way back. Just so like there's nothing coming the other way. So we've made it to the top of Sky. We are just heading round to the castle at the minute. And we've got to the top of the hill and Andrew spotted a spam van. So of course he had to have some spam, but look at that view. Isn't that gorgeous? And it's a lovely sunny day. Yeah, so we just did Fairy Glen, which was lovely. The road wasn't the nicest to go down or to get out of. Um, <laughs> I think it's one of them where, where I've kind of overestimated what it was going to be, but it was nice. If I'd have known that that's all that was going to be there, I probably wouldn't bother again. But now we're going to the castle on the other side, because we've got three days of really, really nice weather, and then weeks of rain by the looks of it. So we're trying to get as much done while it's nice and sunny. Look at this view, how pretty that is. And there is a campsite down there, which we looked at, but it's 48 pound. £48 to stop there. We were like, no, no, we'll just keep going. We'll find a wild camp spot. How pretty it is. Time for something to eat. And it's been a while since we've actually had some takeaway food. We thought we'll treat ourselves to a nice... We thought we'll treat ourselves to something nice, my love. So I'm having bacon and black pudding. And Andrew's having sausage bacon and tomato because he's boring. And there is the little ferry bridge. So they've closed this road off. You can get down to here, which is the car park, but the road afterwards is closed off. We are actually just at the park, just to the top of here, at the other end of the road that's still open. That you're allowed to park on, but we have to take a walk down to it because it is so pretty. Yes, and this is called the ferry bridge. Look how magical it looks. So you've got this gorgeous water running all the way through. Down to the ferry bridge. And then when you go through the ferry bridge, there's a load of flowers I'll show you on the other side. So this side there isn't any flowers or anything. But then when you go through, there's just a ton of flowers. And there's little birds nesting in the walls and oh, it's so pretty. Oh, and there's even some fishes in the water. I don't expect to see fish down there. Eh? 
It is day two of being on Sky. Is it? I thought it was day three. Technically day two, because we don't count the day we actually arrived. Oh, we yeah, didn't we do did. anything, we just drove and stopped. Yeah. So we did Fairy Glen yesterday. We also did the Fairy Bridge. We just did Fairy everything yesterday, let's You be did, honest. yeah, yeah, you did lots of Fairy yesterday. <laughs> and then we parked not too far away from... You have to say it, because I say it wrong. Dunvegan. Dunvegan, I'm guessing. Dunvegan Castle. So as you can see, it's behind us. We got here nice and early. The car park, for any mortal homers or anybody who's travelling here, is huge. On Google Maps it looks tiny, yeah. but they've made it even bigger, haven't they? Yeah, they're making it a lot bigger, so yeah, there's plenty of space. Yeah, so you won't struggle for space at all. Yeah. Be warned, there was a queue when we got here. We've had to actually queue to peer and everything, haven't we? <laughs> yeah, so we, we, it was a shock. we arrived at 5 to 10 and it was already a queue to get in, so... And the bus loads, were, there are, it's obviously a, a popular destination because this coach is coming in. So, yeah, just be aware. But it's the same as every tourist attraction, yeah. I guess. And it wasn't badly priced, really, for what it is. No, £16.50 for the Castle of Gardens. And if you're get, if you lucky, you can get on the seal trip. That's an extra £13. Yeah, we haven't bothered with the seal trip. We've no. Scarborough, we've seen them, haven't we? Yep. Too many times. But yeah, so it's meant to be a lovely nice day. And it's the castle. Sorry. And my head. You're, too, you're too short. I've got really shaved now, look. <laughs> you have. Yeah. Oh, right, come on, let's go and have a look. So yes, we're going to go and have... We're going to spend the day here, aren't we? We've decided. We are absolutely spending the day here. It is bank holiday. Bank holiday weekend. Um, we're going to get. We're going to have a wander around the castle and go and grab the dogs and take them around the gardens. We are. That is the plan. Yeah. And have some lunch. Yes. Nevandra. No? No. You see where? Yeah. So pretty. Has the weeping angel got the key to the TARDIS? So we've arrived at our park up back at the pit stop and we're parked next to another auto trail which is uh, a, a 
C63, which we've we've actually reviewed this at the NEC. So it's a lovely, lovely van. Look at those bad boys. Yeah, I'm going to compare them. So, so that's what they've got. And and that's ours for comparison. We we've we've quickly put ours back in. That we've put them in the van because it looks pathetic. You no, know what, what I'll do is I'll put them on the back tires and make it look like we're protecting them that way. I'm oh, going to slide and... yeah, we're going to just put them on the back so it makes sure that we don't slip and then it looks like there. Yeah. I've never been so like. Are they overcompensating for something? <laughs> though? Is it? It's embarrassing, but yeah. So yeah, lovely people. We've just, lovely I was people. Say, but we have just got back from Sky. A bit of sweet, is that the right word? Because we've had the best weather ever. It's been beautiful weather. Yeah. Let's let's spin round. Let's have a nice view. Oh, look at that. You can't, because you know you're going to get all the traffic that's gone past. So yeah, but it was absolutely stunning. The weather was amazing. We had a good four days, which was beautiful, wasn't it? Oh, it's, I, did, I, I was trying to think of anywhere that I've been that's just more beautiful I mean you just run out of names for it but I absolutely am, stunning I am quite pleased we left when we left off because on the way back it's bank holiday Saturday so on the way and as we were coming off we must have passed with about easy 100 vans yeah. going on I just like yeah no. we prefer it when it's a little it's, bit more quiet it's going to be it's heat it's going to be heaving on sky oh, this is, weekend yeah. bank holiday weekend I mean we've we've had the weather it's just turned in the last hour or so it's, it, you can feel the temperatures dropped a little bit and the clouds have come over, but we've it's been spectacular. It has. What a place. And cheaper fuel on the island than the garage just before it. Oh, that was a little win today. <laughs> £1.51. Uh, as yeah, as her on there. Yeah. And be... then the garage before you got onto Sky was, what was it, one one fifty eight. One fifty eight. And then there's a garage just before you get to where we are here, which is the pit stop. Um, we came past it. <laughs> it's £1.89. Crazy. Um, don't stay there. No. So tip for anybody that's coming on to Sky, um, head to Asda. Yeah, and pit stop, you'll see it on yeah. the bridge, it's £5 a night. £5 a night, how can you go wrong with that? And and 5G? Wow, no, it's about 17G, so and a look at the view. Yeah, you've got a beautiful view. Yes, there is a road here, but yeah. we, we've hit, we're roads. Yeah. Right, we're okay. going to get these yeah, out. So yeah, bank holiday weekend, parked up out the way of everybody, without our levellers, which are... I feel inadequate today. <laughs>